Hello numerous fans, even though we probably only have one after that long gap in our videos. We've decided his that fault. Yeah, we we haven't made a video in uh, so long. So we decided just to make this quick one where we're going to go on the internet and find our favorite kind of jokes, which is anti-jokes. Freaking hilarious stuff. So um a man walks into a bar, except it's a metal bar, like a pole, so he gets hurt. A dyslexic man walks into a bra. If life gives you melons, you're probably dyslexic. <laughs> That's a good one. Thank you. Okay. We'll have, okay. To, we'll, we'll have to edit out the pauses in between videos, okay. though, right? What's worse than finding a worm in your apple? The Holocaust. I've heard that one before. Roses are red, violets are blue, dandelions are yellow. You probably thought this was going to be something romantic, but it's just a bunch of gardening facts. Roses are red, violets are blue, I have a gun, get in the van. What's red and smells like blue paint? Red paint. Alright. Uh, why did the boy drop his ice cream? He got hit by a bus. An Irishman walks out of a bar. Um. We have to edit out the pauses, don't we? Mm-hmm. You can start with that. Okay. Shut up, bitch. How do you confuse a blonde? Paint yourself green and throw forks at her. Why was six afraid of seven? It because wasn't. seven was a six offender. It wasn't. Numbers not sentient and therefore incapable of feeling fear. I think mine was better. Because like seven was a six better. offender. No, I like mine better. Okay, I have a real joke, though. Okay, so a little boy walks in on his dad masturbating. And the little boy says, Daddy, what are you doing? The dad says, I'm masturbating, son, and you'll be doing it very soon, too. The little boy says, Why, Daddy? And he says, Because my arm's fucking killing me. <laughs> That's fucking terrible. <laughs> We're putting that oh on the video. My God. We are putting That's that on the terrible. video. Can we please put that on the video? <laughs> my uncle told that one to me. That's bad. That's Thank you. pretty bad. It's funny though, right? Oh my god. What did the uh, hobo get for Christmas? Nothing, he was a hobo. What did the boy with no arms and no legs get for Christmas? Cancer! Okay, have you ever heard of a shaggy dog joke? Yes, they are long jokes that basically make you, like, think, like, well then, really long jokes lead to nothing. Exactly, okay, so here's one, okay. Oh god. So, um, a father is deciding what to buy his son for Ping his pong birthday, balls. right? Uh, well... You gonna ruin the joke for me? Or? Yes, yes I am. So a father is deciding what to buy his his son for his birthday, and so he goes he goes up to his son and he asks what his son wants, and the son says, "I'd like ping pong balls." So the father goes to the store and buys a bunch of ping pong balls and uh, brings them back to the boy, and then leaves them with him. He leaves the room for a second, comes back, and all the ping pong balls are gone. And he asks the boy, "What happened to the ping pong balls?" And the boy's like, "I don't know what happened." So, a couple years later, the boy's grown older, and he wants a car. So, his dad goes out, buys a car, and just as a joke, fills it with ping pong balls. And the boy comes up, he sees a car, he laughs a little bit, and so the dad goes inside for a second to get him both a drink. The dad comes outside, all the ping pong balls are gone. And he asks his son, where are the ping pong balls? And the son's like, I don't know where they went. So, years later, the boy is now married, he has a family... And he needs a house. So his father bought him a house right across the street for him. And he was being so crazy about it that he filled the house to the brim with ping pong balls. There's ping pong balls in the bedrooms, in the toilets, in the kitchen, everywhere. And so the son walks up and he sees it and he laughs a little bit. And then the father is watching from across the street at his house. He turns around a second to get something and he turns back and all of them are gone. And he's standing there in awe because he don't know where all of these ping pong balls went. So it turns out that the son had developed cancer. So he's lying on his deathbed. His father comes in. His father asks, Son, before you die, I just want to ask one thing. What happened to all those ping pong balls? And the son's like, Okay, Dad. I, and then he died. That is the lamest joke in the history of I think that is my favorite Earth. joke that I've ever... Okay, so a priest, a rabbi, and a shaman walk into a bar. Except there's no rabbi and shaman. And it's my eighth birthday. And the priest is molesting me. And the priest is my dad. And he's not a priest. My dad molested me. A lot. <laughs> That's terrible. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, okay, okay. Why can't Michael J. Fox draw a perfect circle? Because drawing a perfect circle is impossible for any human. Lol. Nice. Thank you. 
Okay, so a man walks into doctors and says, Doctor, I feel like a pair of curtains. That's the least of your problems. You have AIDS. <laughs> your friend is so gay he has consensual sex with other men and enjoys it. How do you make a plumber cry? You kill his family. People murder. A man walks into a bar, he's an alcoholic, and he's ruining his family. That's terrible. Why did the homeless man what did the homeless man get for Christmas? I already Brandon. said that, Brandon. You oh, repeated Brandon. my joke, you F hole. What do you call a man with no arms and no legs water skiing? I don't know, but it sounds a high, like a highly improbable circumstance. A duck walks into a bar, animal control is promptly called in and the duck is released into a nearby park. Why do black leap fried chicken? Why? Because it tastes good. Yeah. You know what? We should we should do black jokes. No, that is too bad. That we are not doing that. I think we should. No, that is to awful. To all the black people out there, we're not trying to be offensive. He is, but I'm not. But some of them are incredible. I have a okay. black friend. Okay, and what about Mexican jokes? Okay. Really? Why are there no Mexican Olympics? Because all the ones that can run, jump, and swim are already over here. Three Mexicans in a car. Who's driving? Who? The police. What do you get when you cross a Mexican in a Chinese wedding? What? A whole lot of fucking rice. <laughs> I love that one. Okay. Let's see this. By the way, we're in bed together. Not... Yeah. Oh, God. We are in the same bed currently, and neither of us is wearing pants. Oh, look pants. at this. Okay, look at this. We, I went to a place, Comedy Central Jokes, and there's, like, different categories. Oh, Which, my God. There's pickup lines, dirty jokes, nationality jokes, insults. Dark humor. Where's insults? Okay, insults. I guess we're doing that. Sorry, we just found a new website. Okay. 411. Lol. What is four? Is that the police? You're so stupid. You had to call four one one to get the number for nine one one. That wasn't really funny. It is four one one is like the what's it called? Teleperson. Is that really? Is are you really that bald or is your neck just blowing a bubble? <laughs> <laughs> that was stupid. You know, that was so stupid. mean. Walks oh walks into a bar I like these ones. Okay. Okay, wait. A horse walks into a bar. The bartender says, "Why the long face?" The horse said, "My grandmother just died." A man walks into a bar, drinks a couple of beers, and prepares to leave. The bar pa bartender tells him he owes eight dollars, but I already pay paid you. Don't you remember? Says the customer. Okay, says the bartender. If you say you paid, then I suppose you did. The man goes outside and tells the first person he sees that the bartender can't keep track of whether his customers have paid or not. The second man rushes in, orders a couple of beers, and later pulls the same stunt. And the barkeep replies, Okay, if you say you pay, then I suppose you did. The customer goes outside and tells a friend how to get free drinks. The third man hurries to the bar and begins to drink highballs. The bar bartender leans in over and says, You know, a funny thing happened tonight. Two men were drinking beer, neither paid, and both claimed they had. The next guy who tries that son is going to get punched in the... The man interrupts, Don't bother me with your troubles, bartender. Just give me my change and I'll be on my way. But this is these aren't really funny. No, what the hell are you on? I don't know. Never go into Comedy Central. Never. It's stupid. Fuck. Funny jokes. Anti jokes are funnier than those. Funnyjokes.com. You know, you know, Reddit's the best for anti jokes. Reddit. Yes. What are the key um What are the key points of moving to Switzerland? Well, the flag's a big plus. <laughs> Get it? Cause the flag is. A Plus. It is. Um. Reddit should... WTF. I like. Dude, we should read FML. No, those are like, um, WTFs or pictures. Go to anti joke. You know what? No, 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 I'm going to FML. Oh, no. We're, this is an anti joke segment. We've already drifted too far off course and it's nine minutes long. No, nope. FML. We're doing FMLs now. I'm sorry. It's his okay. fault. <clears throat> Today, my vegan boyfriend told me that if you were forced to kill another. E kill either his cat or me, he'd kill me because he would never kill an animal. <laughs> my turn. Go. Ah, oh. shit. Go. Today I had to explain to my husband that the five second rule doesn't apply if you drop the floss into the toilet. <laughs> FML. That's awesome. Okay. Today I walked into my mother's house to find that she had knitted clothes for some of the household appliances. The toaster was wearing a dress. That was Ooh. really funny. My turn. Today, as per usual, my mother went to see her psychic, who told her that one of her children is harboring a dark secret. Now we're all grounded unless one of us confesses our obviously non-existent secret. FML. <laughs> okay, let's look for a funny one here. Oh, I got a good FML that I read before, Brandon. Brandon? I know a good FML I read before. Point it at me. Now. Okay. 
So today I was jogging and I saw this guy I liked and I was really sweaty, so I wiped my face on a leaf. Apparently a bird decided to do the same with his ass five minutes ago. <laughs> FML. <laughs> I read that one before on this website. That's, That's a terrible. good one. Today the girl of my dreams asked me if I wanted to go biking with her. Just the two of us, she said. I had to turn her down because I'm 17 years old and I never learned how to ride a bike. Oh. <laughs> that sucks. Fuck. <laughs> okay. God. Today I decided to go to a UV light party dressed in all white. Before leaving, my little brother dumped a glass of tomato juice all over my head saying, Now you look just like a used tampon. FML. <laughs> okay. Um, today while trying to quietly sneak a midnight snack with my girlfriend, I was slowly picture? opening the pantry door so I wouldn't wake my mother. My girlfriend came and swung the open door under my foot, taking the top layer of skin with it. Oh. Damn. Okay. Today while having sex with my girlfriend on the bathroom floor, I felt something tickle my balls. I look back to see her sister's kitten getting in on the action. I think I just had my first threesome. FML. That sucks. That sucks. <laughs> okay, let's see if there's like categories. Bestiality. Top, your top FMLs. This is what we want. This is the top FML. Today my husband dropped me off at work. Ten minutes later, I got a text saying, I just dropped the bitch off. I'll be there in a few, baby. I miss you. I asked him about it. He said, I don't know what you're talking about, Megan. My name isn't Megan. Not even close. That uh, sucks. Um, ew. Today I saw an elderly man fall in the crosswalk, so I jumped off my bag to help. As I helped him cross, light turned green. I then walked across, walked across the 6th Lane Street and someone stole my bike. FML. <laughs> yeah. He's... Uh, Uh, today I took the bus to work and a sweet old lady got on after me and sat next to me. Oh, Halfway to work, time. she fell asleep and her head was on my shoulder. Trying to be nice, I gently tried to wake her before my stop came. She wasn't sleeping. I let a dead woman lie on me for 30 minutes. FML. <laughs> today I bit my boyfriend's neck. I felt something squirt in my mouth. Turns out I had just popped a pimple on his neck. Into my mouth. Oh. FML. Grody. Okay. No, oh, get away from uh, me. Dick. Such an ass. Today I texted my boyfriend saying hi. His response, I got your best friend pregnant. FML. Oh! <laughs> what the? Oh, God. <laughs> Can you imagine that? Hi, I got your best friend pregnant. I got your best friend pregnant. Today is my 18th birthday. My parents got me a $5 gift certificate to iTunes. It came for free with the iPhone. They just <coughs> bought my sister for her middle school graduation. FML. Wait, what? It was... Wow. Okay. That's terrible. Today, my first girlfriend of over three years left me for another guy. She said she's looking for someone who can financially provide for her in the future. The dude owns a T-Mobile kiosk. I'm going to medical school. FML. Wow. Ow. Okay, I think I'm done with FMLs after this. Today at the dentist, I was getting my teeth cleaned. Looking up at his nose, I saw runny snot dripping onto his lip. I tried to slowly move away. He told me, stop! The movement of the lips caused the snot to fall right into my mouth. FML. Okay, let's, let's, you know what, what else would be fun? What? We should do, uh, remember before we were talking about inkblot tests? Oh, God. We should do inkblot tests and see what we see. By the way, today we sadly found out that Aiden is color deficient. I could not get a single color test right unless it was completely obvious and not just a blind person wouldn't be able to get it. Yep, so... I'm completely color deficient, and it makes me sad. Here, there's an online Rorschach test. Let's What's a Rorschach this. test? It's an inkblot test. Good, thank God. I was hoping it I was hoping it wasn't more of those color blot tests. Those suck ass. Just because you can never get them any, any of them right? I can get the reverse ones perfectly. Well, yeah, that's a different story. What are you doing? What? No. Okay, here. Georgie Porgy used his Porgy see? group test. What do you see? Um. Kay. We should probably show them the ink blot. Okay, so here's the ink blot. <laughs> Can they see it? No, there, no, there, no. There. So there it is. And it says the options are I see a face in the card. I see a scary face in the card. Things look like they're whirling around in the card. It looks like we're looking down on people or something in the card. I see a mask in the card. Sexual imagery. I see a flower in the card. I see sexual imagery in the card. I see sexual imagery. What do you see? Kind of looks like we're looking down on a country. I don't know. I see a 
I see a giant land mass. I see a... I don't know. So I choose to look like we're looking down on people or something in the card. I think... I think okay. This isn't fun. Yeah, you fun. don't have people or something in the this card. Isn't, this isn't funny. It's not supposed to be funny. We're absolutely comedy, not absolutely shit-ass boring. Okay, okay, what do you want to do then? I don't know. Our video is already 15 and a half minutes long. This one just looks like fucked up. If I, I can get it to... I haven't even... Oh, look wow. That, look at that. Looks like a looks vagina. Like, no, yeah, it kind of looks like... Wait, with testicles right there. No, those look like women look lying like on, like, lying on a huge... Testicle? Vagina. I think. I don't know. We also learned that Brandon is metrosexual today. I'm not metrosexual. At all. Oh, really? Other than... I care about my hair, that's it. Yes, you do. Get away from me. I didn't touch your nipple. Get away from me. I did not touch your nipple again. Uh, this is over. What's over? Us. Oh. We're over. Well, we're in bed together. You can't say we're that well. We're in bed together. We are. We're laying on a bed together. Without pants. <laughs> we... <laughs> Neither of us have pants on. This is not gay at all. I have a girlfriend, just so everyone knows. It's me. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Stop oh, God. trying to convince them that Wait until Shanae sees this. Stop trying to convince them that I'm gay. I'm not. And I like a girl, but, you know, she doesn't like me back. That kind of shit. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Yeah, She'll never like me. Why not? Because you're a creepy asshole? Because I'm color deficient. <laughs> she's not going to like you because you're color deficient? Yeah, she's not going to like me because I can't see colors. Because you, like, if she asks you to pass the blue... Pass crayon. the blue crayon. I have to look at the letters instead of looking at the woods, so yeah. Pass the blue crayon. Which, which I one? Can't. Which fucking one? Here, it's yellow. Aw, oh, shit. That's terrible. Hey, what the. Now we're the, you know what? We're the two stooges. You know now we're watching Two Girls, One Cup. <laughs> Aiden. I'm leaving. Aiden. I'm leaving you. Uh, Aiden still has not seen the video Two Girls, One Cup, and. He denies, he doesn't ever want to see it, and I've been trying to make him watch it. So if you want to, him to watch it too, go on Twitter. Subscribe. Subscribe, stuff like that. Really, we don't care, we just want you to subscribe. Like, like we really give a hey. fuck. Hey guys, how you doing? This is what I have to deal with. He loves it. He loves it so much. So much, it's almost gay. Two. <laughs> I'm going to go sleep on the couch. I'm not looking it up. I just saw you type in two girls. No, I'm not. It's not here. There, clear iPod. Chill. Right. I'm not wearing underwear. Okay, so what do you want to do for the rest of the video? Well, I think the video's done. I think, I think we should do other stuff. Well, I think we should set this, separate this into a few videos. Well, I guess this is goodbye. No, we could probably do some more videos. I thought, are we leaving or not? Because then I just did an awkward goodbye scene. We could cut that out. Oh, that hurts my ears. Peace. Next time, we'll do an actual video. A, a good video. This was just a random spur of the moment. Shit. Because it's like um almost one in the morning and we're tired. And we thought we might as well post something just to let you know that we are still gonna post oh, videos. I need I need to shout out to a couple of my friends. Okay, do shout outs, I don't care. Hey Sebastian, Marcus, Damien, screw you, Chris, hey Bailey. I love you all. And everybody else in my school except, you know, Max. I'm kidding. I love you all. I love you too, Max. Peace. Max is fat. Who cares? Me.